up, guys? I'm McKenzie, and welcome to the final episode of Season 1 one of the Arsenal Recruitment. If you guys enjoyed the video, say be sure to like button, subscribe, and invite some video sessions down below. But we're into the final episode. We have four games remaining. We're going to put this all into one episode, and hopefully, well, we should have four games remaining. Uh, hopefully, we, we do well. Yeah, it's been a journey, but this is the final episode of Season 1, so I can't wait to get into it. We're in the Champions League semi-final second leg against Paris Saint-Germain. Uh, yeah, we're winning 4-2 in aggregate. As long as we don't lose by 2, we should be going through to the final, which is good. Aubameyang is the top scorer, but without fucking around any longer than I already have, let's just get into the semi-final, hopefully beat BSG, and we've already seen the finalists. We'll be playing if we get through Atletico Madrid in the final. Come on, boys. That is our team. It's our strongest possible team, apart from Debussy and Coughlin. Fuck. Let's do it. Okay, here we are. We are at exactly. Pass oh. the Princess. Yay. All I've got to do is avoid defeat, and we're into the Champions League final. We can do this. This is exciting times ahead. Last episode of the season. Oh, PSG are through. So it's gone wide. We go to Bamiang. Plays in Royce. 1 0. There we go. Bamiang passes it through to Royce. And Royce pretty much puts the tie to bed. It's now 5 2 in aggregate. With three goals ahead, I don't see them coming back from this. What a good goal here. Bamiang just plays it through and it's just a good finish second touch bottom corner one nil thank you very much okay what the fuck are you doing holy street Mustafi you piece of shit oh Caval check oh for fuck's sake check fuck me what the fuck was that well what the fuck are you doing check what the actual fuck are you doing I don't know how PSG missed that that goal but uh, why the fuck didn't he catch the first one? Okay, well, it's one all now. 5-3 in aggregate. I doubt we're going to concede two more in 20 minutes. But, fuck you, check. For the elbow. Two! Coughlin! Two one! Back in front! Three, uh, six, three on aggregate now. We're back with our goal in front in this tie. What a good play there. Coughlin with a sweat. Almost fucks it up. But he does it brilliantly and it's 2-1. It's Olivier Giroud. He's somehow broken through the defense. Can he fuck up? He can fuck up. He fucks up in style. Kishouti! Okay, save. And that'll be it. 2-1 win in this game, 6-2 in aggregate. It'll be surely ended there. Thank you very much. In to the Champions League final with no sweat broken at all. Thank you very much. Check tried to fuck us up. Fuck you, Check. But we go through in the end, 6-3 in aggregate. Too easy, boys. Okay, into the second game of the episode, we're playing Stoke City. We've already won the league. Well, mathematically, we haven't. We're nine points ahead of Tottenham. They have three games left. But realistically, we've, we've won the league. All we've got to do is get a point today, and we've definitely won the league so let's go get it here we are into the game against stoke city at the britannia stadium stokes stoke city fc stadium what the hell is was the britannia well see we are champions realistically oh what the fuck is with this pitch a bummy yang is currently three goals off equaling a premier league real life record for goals in a season set by andy cole and alan shearer 34 goals each a bummy yang's on 31 i want him to equal that record at least so we're going to try and make him equal that record it's through now for Schneider. Oh, for fuck you, you dickhead. Here we go. It's Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. Here's your chance for your goal, mate. One nil. There we go. That's goal number 32. We've got two more goals, and it equals the goal scoring record in Premier League history. He's going to make history, boys and girls. Two goals off with a game and a half left. Can he do it? I hope he can. Here we go to Aubameyang through again. Can he get another goal? He's going to cut back in. That was a weird way to fucking control it. Oh, well done, Aubameyang. Unbelievable. Did not see that one coming, but it's 2-0, and he's now a goal off. What a good turn in. Okay, he really pissed me off here, but somehow it's finished. Butlin's turned to piss, and it's 2-0 now. Aubameyang, two goals in two and three minutes, and it's now 2-0. Aubameyang is one goal away from the Premier League record. Aubameyang! Oh! Almost getting his hat trick. It's just wide, but it goes into half time at 2 0 up. Oxley Chamberlain, Aubameyang, finish it! Oh, it's just gone over the bar. Yes, Kieran Gibbs, 3 0. There we go. Kieran Gibbs, the most unlikeliest of scorers, has got a goal for us here. Wraps it up 3 0. And uh, yeah, this is some good play and a good finish by Kieran Gibbs into the bottom corner. Oh, that's up. 
Oh, that's some brilliant play. It's sent through Walcott. He's through on goal. He's somehow been caught by fucking Shakiri, But it doesn't matter because he's got not going to score anyways. But we'll win 3-0. And there it is. The title is confirmed. Will we have title celebrations now? Or will we have it in the next game? Our last home game. We are going to have our celebrations at our last home game. Well done. Well, we've definitely won the league now. Aubameyang's only one goal off top of the uh, top goal scorer in all history. So... Happy days. All right, guys, into the final game of the final game of the episode. It's actually not the final game of the episode. Third game of the episode, playing Everton, my team, last league game of the season. Then we've got the Champions League final. We're going to collect the league title today. Uh, my faith cam's being a little cunt. Let's go. Here we go, final Welcome game of the all. season. Um, league games. We're playing my team, Everton, at the Emirates, Emirates Stadium. We're going to pick up the Premier League title today. Why is Sigurdsson signed for Everton? Yeah, the fuck? So. Scandal away. Aubameyang needs one more goal to equal a Premier League record. Record. Let's give him that fucking goal, lads. Come on, Aubameyang. Score it, mate. Oh, straight at fucking second blur. It's Aubameyang again. Turn, shoot, fucking miss. Yes. Here we go. It's Aaron Ramsey. Can he find Aubameyang? Oh, he's offside. How are you offside? Wait, what? Is he offside? He scored. Oh. Yes. Aubameyang. What, no, what the fuck? Why did I think he was offside? He was not offside. I'm a dickhead. He's equaled the record. There we go. I'm a dickhead. Here's a chance to send through Aubameyang. He could be breaking the record here. Can he score? Save! Miss. You're a dickhead. Dickhead. Aubameyang. Yes, get past Jags. And bury it. How have you fucking missed? Royce. Plays it back to Aubameyang. You dickhead. Oh, yes. Here we go. Oxley Chamberlain to Aubameyang. He's one-on-one -on -one with the keeper. He's surely got to smash the record now. Yes! There we go! Aubameyang gets goal number 35 in the Premier League season. He smashed the record set by Andy Cole and Alan Shearer. And now he's got one better than them and scored a 35th minute, 35th season goal. Look at that finish outside of the boot. Makes it 2-0. Puts the game beyond doubt with five minutes remaining. Yes! Why? Now he's going to come off because he's extremely tired. Oh, Barkley. Good save, Pedicek. What a save. It's 2-0. There's a minute left. If we were to get the ball, Perez could go and score here. We're not going to get the ball. They've got Stecklenburg up for some reason in a Premier League game last game of the season. But it doesn't matter. 2-0. We're champions of England. Confirmed. That was confirmed a few weeks ago. But now we're going to pick up the title in our medals. Fuck yes, boys. We've done the double. Now we've got the Champions League final in a week and a half. And we've got to go and do the treble. And here we go. The big moment. The Premier League title is there. Look at it. Beautiful. Koscielny is the captain. He is the man who will lift the trophy. Ugh. Here we go. Let's see it. Lauren Koscielny. Hell yeah. Taking your time. Fucking lifted already. That was shit. I don't feel satisfied, but that zoom in at all. What a shit zoom. Yay, we're champions of England. Woohoo. We've also won the League Cup. What a victory. What a great, great moment. It's momentous. Yay. There it is. Awesome. Sick one, lad. Holy fucking shit! Motherfucker, look at that money! I haven't seen a person finish the season yet. Like, this is new to me. 125 million for winning it? Does that all go towards our... our oh, wait, no. That won't go towards our... Fucking hell, that won't go towards our, um, our transfer, will it? It doesn't go towards our transfer budget. All right, guys, into the final game of the season. We have the Champions League final against Atletico Madrid. I am so excited for this game. I hope you guys are as well. Ah, uh, yeah. It's been a long season. We've had a, very, a lot of fucking games. This is our second cup final. It's a chance for the treble after just winning the league and league cup. Let's do it. Here we go. The Allianz Arena against Atletico Madrid. Madrid again getting another Champions League final. Which is unbelievable. This is like the third in five years or some shit. But Arsenal get to a Champions League final for the first time in a long, long time. So, let's fuck him up. Here we go. Champions League final. Arsenal to get us underway. And we're underway in um, Germany. Hell yeah, boy. Sanchez to Aubameyang to turn. It's the defender's turn. Oh, what a save by Moya! That's unbelievable! We got Ramsey to Aubameyang. Can he make it 1-0? Ozil! Off the post! And out! 
Oh, fucking keepers dropped it. Did not think that. I think I also called him the wrong keeper before. But Ramsey safe. It's O'Black. Yeah, I said Moya, I'm pretty sure. Don't know where the fuck that came from. Aubameyang, yes, he's in. Can he finish off the post again? What a shit shot. But it's the second time we've hit the woodwork. And we're not even half hour into the game. Oh my fucking god. Sanchez into the box. Can he finish it? Saved by the keeper again. Aubameyang through. Ozil. Sanchez. 1-0. Oh! Look at that finish there! Aubameyang plays the ball to Ozil, plays it back, and he fucking roulettes it into the goal! I think that's what you call it! Look at that! A black was done! That's better than the one he scored against that team in real life the other day! What a finish that is! He's just absolutely mugged them off! Alexis Sanchez! You talk about flair and shit! That's about as far as you go! Champions League final! The biggest club stage of them all! And he manages to do a little fucking pirouette in the ball and hit it in the back of the net. Past one of the best keepers in the world. I do not believe my eyes. We're winning 1-0 now. And it's not even a bummy yang that scored. Fucking... What a goal, Sanchez, you legend. Now to Bamiang. What can he do? He's going to slip it through. Again for Royce. Save. Oh, word. Okay, we are absolutely destroying them. That wasn't even Royce. That was Xhaka. Penalty, the free kick. Corner even. Last chance of the half. Gets it in. Bamiang hit it back out to the... Shit, your shit. Now it's Bamiang. Oh, great turn. Pierre Emerick and Bamiang cuts in. Finesse's bottom corner. Oh, 2-0. In the Champions League final, that could seal it. That could be all she wrote. What a finish by Bummy and Great turn, edge of the box, cuts in, top corner, having a laugh. Third time we've hit the woodwork. Doesn't fucking go out this time. It's his ninth goal in the Champions League. He's outright top goal scorer in this competition as well now. It's 2 0. What a finish! Two world class goals in the Champions League final. And Atletico Madrid looked like they're heading towards another European heartbreak and another Champions League final. But Arsenal looked like they could be storming towards the first Champions League title. Go, Ozil. Play it down for Sanchez. Sanchez is in the box. He cuts back out. Plays it to Jordi Elba. Finish it for three! 3 0! It's two in five! And that could be it! That could be all over now! With, tw with 35 minutes still left to play could be fucking over what a finish well done sanchez finding jordi alba don't know why he's there but he's put it in the bottom corner like a world-class striker he's done something that bummy ain't would be proud of and it's now three nil and i believe that is game over now there's no way madrid are coming back into this game from three nil down it could get worse though it really could get worse which is sanchez no it's four it's 4-0! Sanchez scores another worldie here! What a finish by Alexis Sanchez! Top corner again, almost. It's 4-0! It's 4-0 in the Champions League final. We've ripped Atletico Madrid a new one. He's only scored two this season in the Champions League, both in the final. What a little legend. I can't, I can't believe what's happening. I know about Atletico now through. They're just playing their way. They've hit the bar. They've hit the bar, and now it's going to be cleared out. Oh, they're through. It's Antoine Griezmann. It's probably going to be a goal. Great save, Petr Cech. And another good save. It stays 4-0. He's going to keep his clean sheet. And he's going to be happy with that. We've got a minute left of regulation time. We can clear that ball out. Come on, there we go. That should be that. And out of time. We're out of time now. This is the last chance for Atletico. They've kicked it out. Now that is fucking shit. Let's just end this here. Royce gets tackled. That should be that. It should be Oshiro. And there, the treble is done in style. 4 0 in the Champions League final. What a bloody finish. What a, what a fucking game. What a game. Four classy, classy goals. Sanchez with some ridiculous tackles and with a great finish from outside the box. You got Royce or Aubameyang, top corners, unbelievable. And even Alba getting a good finish in the wrong corner. It's 4 0 win the Champions League. Final. The treble is complete. Won nearly everything. Next season, we're going to win everything. But what a bloody season we've had. Because is now going to lift his second trophy in just two weeks. He's going to start getting sore arms soon with these fucking trophies that he's lifting. And here we go. Warren Kashelny. Time to lift the Champions League final cup. Terrible zoom incoming now. 3 2 1. Boom! Shit zoom. But it's a Champions League trophy, so we don't give a shit about the it's 4-0 in the 
final. What a day, what a victory. This has gone better than I ever expected. There they go, away to the Arsenal supporters. The, sh the shine on the Champions League trophy is ridiculous. Like, actually ridiculous. But we'll take it. What a fucking game. What a dominating performance that was. 17 shots we had. Absolutely destroyed them. We come away completing the treble with um with our first season. This is only going to be a two-season career mode. Next season is pretty much let's go win every single trophy we can. There's going to be five that we can go for. So that's pretty much the plan for next season. We finished 13 points ahead of um, Tottenham with 91 points. Aubameyang scored 35 goals and I think he only played... 31. 47 goals in 47 appearances. What a fucking stat that is. With an average rating of 8.1. Alright, fuck EA. I don't get this. I tried all season to make sure I finished this priority because I did this one, I did this one, I pretty much did this one, and I'm going to do this one. And I really wanted to do this one. Why did I want to do this one? Because I'm an, a completionist, right? Grow two youth academy players by at least 10 overall play, um, points. Play them in five matches, either as part of the starting 11 or as a sub. Alright, sweat freight sweet for fucking sweet enough. Nicholas Snyder up by 10. And if it, yeah, Paul Hayes both up by 10. And you guys have both known that I've played both of these guys like into about 15 times each, probably more than that. Yep, didn't count as finishing it. I don't give a shit. Also, Bellerin doesn't want to sign a new contract after asking for a new contract because that's fucking FIFA logic. Stoke City qualified for the Champions League. Middlesbrough and Crystal Palace are in the Europa League. What? Champions Leicester finished 11th. Everton finished 10th. With City, Liverpool and 8th finishing 9th, 8th and 7th. What the fuck? Spurs were 2nd! Bournemouth, Burnley and Sunderland both went down with Hull City only staying up on... Uh, on goal difference. So that's all that happened this season. Now we're going to end the season and we're going to end the episode and our season here while we didn't achieve all our objectives. Do you want to Do you want to fuck off? Do you want to all fuck off? Do you want to write fuck off? We didn't achieve all our objectives. Well, it turns out we did, but you don't want to say that we did. But we're not going to end it on a sour note. We did win the Premier League. We did win the Champions League. We did not focus our camera. We did win the League Cup. We won everything that we could apart from the FA Cup. So I'm pretty happy by that. Okay, next season we're going to win everything. But until then, you're going to have to come back soon enough. Next few days. But until then, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. It's been a pleasure doing this season with you. Come back for season two very soon. Tell me what you think. Hit the like button if you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. And I will see you in season two.